Here's how to fix visual intelligence if it's not working on your iPhone. Now, if you have an iPhone and you're trying to press and hold that side button to enable visual intelligence, but it's just not working, I'm gonna walk you through the entire process to get that fixed. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me. Thanks, guys. Now, there are some requirements on here. So the Apple support page says visual intelligence is allowed or an option on all iPhone 16 models. So keep in mind, you need iPhone 16, iPhone 16 Pro or iPhone 16 Pro Max. So we'll search to see if we have that. So let's hop into the settings. We'll tap on general and about here. So you can see at the very top is model iPhone 16 Pro. And then above that is the iOS version. That is another requirement. You need iOS 18.2. So if you don't have that, you can go back and hit software update and just update to the latest version of the iOS operating system. Currently it's 18.2. After you've done both of those troubleshooting steps, what we're gonna do is go back out of here and go to Apple Intelligence. Now, if the visual intelligence isn't working, what I found is just toggling off Apple Intelligence and then waiting maybe 10, 15 seconds and turning it back on essentially will allow your Apple Intelligence to reinitiate and it might download some software onto there basically to allow it to use Apple Intelligence. Now, after we've done that, let's try it again. On the very side button here, we're gonna press and hold on it, and it should show up with sort of a colorful background, and now at the very bottom, it should show ask and search. It shouldn't show the normal camera, it should just show the ask and search. Now, if these both don't work, then sometimes the Apple intelligence needs to download and install software onto your iPhone to make it enabled. So to do that, what you're gonna do is physically plug in your phone and you're going to turn it off or just like leave it off, not physically off, but just leave it off, plugged in, connected to Wi-Fi. So when it's connected to Wi-Fi and it's plugged in, it will download and install all of the Apple intelligence files that it needs to run that. And after waiting maybe 30 minutes or so, it should be fixed, it should be done, and it should be working on your phone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.